Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel SQL and Our Science. As we discussed in our previous video, platform tests are performed on each can to assess the quality of incoming milk before it is accepted and weighed. These tests must be easy to perform, give quick and reliable results, and should not require complicated and elaborated equipment. Alcohol test is one of them and today we are going to discuss how to do it and how to interpret the results. Alcohol test is used as platform test for rapid determination of elevated acidity of milk. It is used on fresh milk to indicate whether it will coagulate on thermal processing. And this test is especially important for the manufacture of UHT milk, evaporated milk and milk powders. This is based on tendency of milk protein to get unstable as a result of disturbance in the mineral balance of milk. Milk with high developed acidity or having calcium and magnesium compounds in greater than normal amounts will coagulate when alcohol is added. Increased level of albumin and salt concentrates may also result in a positive test. Now let's see how to do the alcohol test. 1 ml of milk is measured into a clean test tube and 1 ml of alcohol is added. We can use 68%, 70% and 72%. Then the sample is mixed and is observed whether there are milk clots on the wall of the test tube. Here in the picture you can see how we can observe the negative results and also the positive results. If mixing of equal quantities of milk and alcohol in the test tube results the coagulation of proteins, it indicates that milk is sour. This milk is not fit for any process applying pasteurization because the milk proteins in milk are unstable to the temperature. So this is the brief overview of alcohol test which is a platform test in milk processing industry. So if you need clarification please leave a comment. Thanks for watching.